Hi, welcome to the series Learn Excel in 24 hours. In this video, we'll study how to use Excel to calculate simple interest and compound interest. So we put in the data headers first, principal, interest rate, duration. The interest rate we will specify in percentage and the duration that we will specify is in years. So we'll put the principal amount in cell D3, the interest rate in cell D4 and the duration in cell D5. By default we know the formula for simple interest is principal into interest into duration upon 100. Now here because the interest rate is already specified in percentage, simple interest will be simply the product of cells D3, D4 and D5. In case interest rate is put in as a number rather than a percentage which we will see. Now I am just duplicating this. You can see I have again put data headers and we'll be putting the principal interest rate and duration in cells H3, H4 and H5. This time the interest rate has been put in as a number. Then the simple interest calculation will be product H3 to H5 and the whole divided by 100. In either case, the final result will be the same. When interest rate is indicated in percentage, don't divide by 100. When interest rate is specified as a number, divide by 100. Next, we will come to the calculation of compound interest. Now, the formula for compound interest is amount is equal to principal 1 plus R upon 100, the whole raised to N, where P is the principal, R is the interest rate and N is the duration. Now, the same thing holds true in compound interest as well. We need not do R upon 100 if the interest rate is specified in percent. So we use the power formula and put the variables accordingly for amount is equal to principal into 1 plus R the whole is to N that will come into the power function. In this case the duration is 3 years so the power becomes 3. Interest is equal to amount minus principal. So we put that in and we get the compound interest and I have highlighted the simple interest and compound interest in, the, in yellow color. So you can see compound interest for the same principle, for the same interest rate, for the same duration is higher because of the compounding effect. Thank you.